Wickersham Jewelry on Up North at Fours, 12 Days of Christmas. Welcome back to Up North at Four. We're continuing the celebration of our 12 Days of Christmas with Paige Curtis from Wickersham Jewelry. Paige, thank you so much for coming on the show today and also Thanks bringing some uh, She brought jewels. gifts. She did. I she did. brought gifts. <laughs> bearing gifts. This is all for us. Or at least some really good gift ideas. Yes, yeah. right? maybe both. And jewelry's in. Jewelry's in again. Yeah. Yes, it is, absolutely. So what kind of trends are you guys seeing at Wickersham right so now? So we've seen a lot of different things. Um, bracelets are going to be really popular for Christmas time, so I did bring a few of those to look at. Okay, um, okay. And then um, you see a lot of petite jewelry too, so kind of like a little bit smaller things, and layering pendants still is very popular too. Okay, so let's look at the bracelets first. And these are popular, you say, correct? Yes. And bracelets can be worn by males and females. Yeah, absolutely. You brought a combination of both here, I believe, right? I have some um, necklaces for men in this. And the bracelets, well, whoever can really wear them if you want to. Can I look at one of the bracelets? Yeah, absolutely. Okay, so how do you, here we go. Let's see if we can get this in camera four. Is that work right you there? You could be a hand model, Jeff. Have you considered <laughs> that? <laughs> I don't think my fingers are manicured for that, but we'll see. Why not? So what, what, what do we got here, Paige? Uh, walk us through this here. Yep, so what you're going to have here are two tennis bracelets. Those are two different carat weights. And then that petite jewelry I was talking about is in the middle here. So you have this really cute butterfly. Um, we got tons of really cute butterfly jewelry right mm -hmm. now. It's adorable. Okay. Okay. Um, and this kind of latches in the front. So this is super cute, nice petite. You can layer that. And then we just have a nice fashion piece in the end that would be really great for layering or you can wear it by yourself as well. Yeah, and are, do these things go, is it like clothing where they uh, go in and out of popularity, certain styles, like butterflies you mentioned? Is the that butterflies, well, I would say um, uh, there's just a lot of people that really love butterflies. But your tennis bracelet, I mean, those are always going to be popular. They're a staple piece, so you can wear them with literally any outfit. Mm -hmm. Got it. Okay. Uh, I'm curious, though, you keep bringing up the term layering. What do you mean by yeah, that? Yeah, well, I should have done it today. So <laughs> essentially what it would be is like if I have this pendant on here, uh -huh. then I would wear like another one with it or a shorter one. So you can wear multiple up, pieces kinda. at a time. Okay. And same thing with bracelets too. Oh. So, and then they actually started doing it with rings so you can like stack bands. Oh, so you can wear multiple bands. <laughs> Speaking of rings, I was going to say, yeah, you we brought some well. beautiful ones yeah. here. Okay, so you don't just have wedding bands, you have all sorts of rings. Yes. Male and female. What yes. did you bring here today? So today I brought an assortment of different engagement rings. So I have a couple different styles. Um, you can see the nice pear shape with the halo, the solitaires. Um, solitaires are back in style a lot too because you can pair any sort of band with it. If you want a diamond band, one with shapes, anything like that. And then we have another princess halo style and then another halo style here that has a plain band on it as well so there's a nice variety that we have so someone like me who's not like up on their rings right they can come into you and you'd be like you'll walk us through this what matches with what and yes. what's in nowadays and what has and what can stay in the test of time right yeah absolutely. and these rings can all do that okay so let's say uh jeff here walks into the shop and says I'm trying to up my look for 2023 you're looking at him now you're thinking hmm Necklaces could be good for Jeff. Okay. What did you bring in to maybe uh, accessorize yeah, a favorite so one to die with? Gold chains. Big for men. Oh, I can Not see. silver, yes. gold. Gold. I, you know, yeah. No, Jeff, you got to go gold. <laughs> Everybody has their personal preference on their color, but the gold chains are really making a comeback in gold jewelry in general, actually. Let me see this. Okay. Jeff, you could rock With crosses, that. some silver here. Okay, we got okay. that. Okay. Yeah. You think I could? I think you could oh, rock yeah. that. Yeah, yeah. I think that looks good. And obviously there this time is. of year, uh, jewelry's on sort of everyone's mind when it comes to getting gifts. Let's just say, hypothetically, I uh, want to give my wife a little something special for the holidays. If you're watching, by the way, just turn this off for the next like 15 <laughs> seconds or so. How do you guys I walk cannot. people through that, uh, that process? So um, a lot of people have different gifts in mind that they've given, but if they haven't, we do have a wish list at the store. So anybody can actually come in and put something on their wish list. So then you don't have to try as hard and we can just help you. We just pull it up. Um, other than that, we've got great ideas and our associates are super wonderful. So they can help anybody with anything. If you have a picture, doesn't matter what it is, you just come in and we will find something that works for love you. This. Sounds love this. Sounds fantastic. It. And Paige, we love all the work that you're doing. We appreciate you coming on to chat with us today. Yeah, thank you. In the meantime, Time though. We're going to take a break. We'll be right back on Up North at 4. What do you think? Is it me? Let's do it.